Hey everybody, I'm Amy. I'm Dan. We're the Hustle Couple coming at you today with what's sold on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. <laughs> I mean, is it? Is it? Yeah, I don't know. I said yes just because we got a sales on all three platforms, but... This video is called mm -hmm. The Good, yep. The Bad, and The Ugly. Yeah, we got all of that. Uh, there's some really low dollar sales here. eBay <laughs> is particularly dead today. Uh, but we are coming at you anyway because we want to show you real life. And like some days really suck. Yep. Today's one of them. However. However. We are doing a telethon style video today. <laughs> I just sent out 1,200 30% off offers on Poshmark. You did what? I'm trying to meet our goal. I can't manipulate eBay like I can manipulate Poshmark. So okay. I downloaded Poshmark VA. We use a different service called OneShop. I might give it up. I don't know. It's, I don't know. We're trying something. We have two sharing services now, okay? So okay. we pay $25 for Poshmark VA. And I just sent out 1,200 offers using that feature. Mm-hmm. So it sends out offers to anything with a like on it. And you can say like 30% off. So I just did that. So if sales come in while we're filming, we're going to grab them. Yes. Because we're trying to meet our daily goal. And that, my friends, is why a daily goal is important. That's right. Because you, you just got to like hustle to get it. Yeah, you do. Here we go. You really do. Let's start with Mercari. Oh. Throwing me off here. This. <laughs> we, we had 10 of... Okay, if you can find the whole like kit and caboodle for this... Like the whole thing. They're the little people parade float, Disney princess parade floats. Mm -hmm. I know this doesn't seem like us, but yes, uh, it goes for $100. But here's the funny thing. What? We had pieces of it. I think I had eight pieces of it. And we sold each of them for over $10. I think I made more piecing it out. Okay, okay. And I didn't even have the little, I have the little ladies, the little, what are they called? Princesses. The princesses. Sisters. Listed separately because I bought them at a different store at a different time. If they go to this, but I wasn't going to go back and retake pictures. That was just not in my plan. Anyway, these little Princess Parade floats. This is the one for uh, Belle from Beauty and the Beast. It's some books. There's a whole slew of these. And this is the last one. We sold out every single one singularly. Yep. With no oh, look, there's a little book inside. Hey. Okay. All right, whatever. This sold for 11 bucks. Excellent. Great. Bye. I'm keeping looking at my phone. Poshmark is popping off. Uh oh. So much activity over there. We already got one sale. We pulled it. But I'm just thinking, if we can get some more sales while we're doing this, can that I, would can be... Can I reach this bubble wrap over here? Where? I don't know. Hang on. We're really low on shipping supplies. I just have, yeah. Um, update on our move to the garage. Uh -oh. We just talked to April and she's on with us full time for the summer. So we have the help that we need and we are going to move our business into our three and a half car garage. Yikes. We're doing it. We're going to rip the bandaid off and we're just going to move. We're just going to do it. Uh, we have a big old garage that's full of crap. We're going to get rid of the crap and we're going to move the operation. We're getting it out of our house. No more thrifting in the house. That's the word on the street. And then <laughs> we're going to move our closet into, into the closet. here. What? And we're going to have room to like get dressed and have all of our clothes. Oh. Lovely, like real people. What's that going to be like? It's going to be real people like. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Little guy on Mercari is going first class. Oh, I don't have to write anything. Okay, nope. cool. Poshmark. First thing is this little uh, hey. child's wet suit from Coolie Bar. I have no idea what this is, and I believe it came from the bins or an estate sale or something. 46 cents we have into it, and it was new with tags. So this is the brand. I'm not sure if it's a great brand. I think it might be Kohl's or something. I don't know. Somebody will tell me in the comments. It was 46 cents, so it was new with tags. I did not look it up. I just got it and yeah. it looks like this like a little little bodysuit for it's got upf i don't know anyway sold on poshmark for 27 bucks nice not about that at all no yeah, we'll take that there you go thank you 27 dollars
Oh, 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 we got a counter offer. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay, see, the thing is, we gotta make sure we have this stuff. So Dan's gonna have to jump on over to the to the venue. This is a $40 offer for a men's sport coat. Uh -huh, number? 4380. 4380. Oh, it says we do. Oh. Ooh! Yo, this is like the most exciting one <laughs> sold you're ever gonna see in your life. This is real time telethon. <laughs> Hello. Did you like to make an offer? Thank you. We'll take it. 40 bucks. It's a nice jacket for 40 bucks. Do you not want to sell it for 40 bucks? I probably will go ahead and sell it. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we'll sell it. Whatever. Let's sell it. Sell 40 it. bucks. We're trying to reach our goal. The next is a Lululemon top. It is blue and white striped. We've had this for quite some time. I yep. paid $2.99 for it. It's just a workout stretch tank. But it's blue and white striped. There you go. Mm -hmm. Trending. 21 bucks. Sold on the Poshmark. You want to pull it down? Sure. It's around the corner. Yep. You see it? Got eyes on it? No, not yet. No. We're doing whatever. We are really, really low in our sales. Like, we're not even close to hitting gold today. So that's why we're doing this push. We waited till later in the day. It's almost 4 o'clock now. And we're just pushing, pushing, pushing. Uh, and some days is like that. I know that you have to, you know, zoom out when you're thinking about reselling. Every day is not going to be great. But if you can just push a little extra on some of those not great days, highly recommend it. You feel what I mean? You feel? Let's make sure that we don't have a payment issue, shall we? Got it? Forty bucks right there. Thirty of that is profit, so that's thirty more dollars we didn't have before sending out offers. Okay. And it went through, so there we go. Great. Sweet. Next is this is a banger. Banger sale. This is not on an offer. This just was a banger on its own. <laughs> this is a Gucci top. I found it at the bins, I think. No. But no, this came from an estate sale. This is from an estate sale, but we do find Gucci at the bins quite a bit. Dolce and Gucci. This is what the tag looks like. It's tacked on. It's very nice. This is a shell. It's a very thin knit. A lot of the Gucci we get is this really delicate thin knit. Super soft. And I was going to show you the inside tag. It's 100% cashmere. And it's made in Italy. Somebody asked us to uh, authenticate this, and we said no. <laughs> um, because it only, I mean, in the world of Gucci, this is just a, a little piece, and it sold for 75 bucks, yeah. which is great. Uh, we are very confident that it is authentic because we got it at a closet of a lady that had a bunch of Gucci stuff. So um, we're willing to take that risk, and hopefully the person who got this loves it. Yes. We just don't have it in our business model to spend extra on authentication. We do do checks on our own for sure. And if we're not 100% sure, we do not sell it. We don't. We donate it back or we whatever we do. Like, like this. I have a Burberry scarf here that has a sold on Poshmark of this exact scarf. I still won't list it. I'm not, I cannot in good faith. The tag looks off to me. So it's still sitting here and never listed. That's what I mean. <coughs> But this, on the other hand, gorge. And if it was like a, uh, we have had stuff authenticated before, Hermes things, and we're just not luxury goods dealers. Yeah. If it was worth like 300 or something, we probably would pay. But this for 75, you know, you can tell by the quality, like touching that, right? <laughs> oh man. Yeah. Forget about it. You never felt something like this in your whole life. It's like, it's got a little bit of pilling under the armpits, but it, I would never. And I mean never take a sweater shaver to this. No. It's Zero so round. thin. <laughs> <laughs> it's very nice though. Here, make sure you put a thank you sticker on there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. See, I have to scroll through the offer screen. There's a lot of scrolling that's happening because so many offers are going out. 
It hasn't even finished sending offers. But some people are counter offering the offer and it gets buried. So I don't want to miss anything. Which is what happened with that suit. Wish there was a way to be like separate you sending an offer versus someone sending, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like another tab. More tabs. All the tabs. All the tabs. <laughs> All right. All right. So uh, next is a bundle. Bundle. This did not sell in the sale. This sold this morning before the sale. And these are all really interesting things. I don't know why this, but this is a very straight, it's a fundle. Fundle. Right. And I'm still scrolling. <laughs> How am I supposed to catch these? I'm going to have to do a final scroll at the end of the video and just see what happens. Ooh. The first item in the fundle is a Vince Chunky Knit, which is awesome. I love Vince Knits for myself. Sometimes we can get a lot for them if they're like cashmere. I'm still scrolling, y'all. <laughs> Whoa. This is insane. Oh, These oh. are all really old items, too. Yeah, so that's great. I don't think it was a viewer. I didn't recognize the name. Do you have the name on the label? Yeah, I want to. Sometimes the Poshmark bundles are viewers, and I want to acknowledge you, but I don't think Annette? so. Annette? I don't think so. Annette? Dallas, Texas. Oh, it's going to Dallas. It's staying in Dallas. That's fantastic. Yes. Okay, so here's Vince. Uh, a lot of people don't sell this brand, but we love it. This is a really chunky short. This is a cool shirt. I probably should have kept this, huh? <laughs> Oh, I could have rocked this with some leggings. Okay, anyway, really heavy, thick, open knit. That's words I would use to describe this. There are a couple pulls on it, but nothing, nothing tragic. Tragic. <laughs> okay, and then this is the third oldest thing in our inventory. Yes. I don't know where it came. I literally could not, I don't know. I do not know how this came into our house. Where did it come from? I couldn't tell you. Okay, this is a brand we don't pick up. Never even heard of it ever before in my life. Did it come in like a... Thread up or something? Maybe? We've been reselling for almost five years. We, this is the third oldest thing. It's See You Monday, I don't know. It's a cold shoulder, thin uh, turtleneck. But it has, you know, like long sleeves. It's like thin. It's nice, it's ribbed. But the pictures were not great. Nope. <laughs> That's why I think maybe a viewer brought this. They felt sorry for us. <laughs> pictures at the time. Right? Oh, I was like, oh, look at that. It's so pathetic looking. Uh, so here we go. So that was the second thing in the bundle. And the third thing was this philosophy gift set. I tried, I used to go get my birthday gift. So my birthday's on Monday, y'all. So excited. Um, I used to go get my birthday gift at Sephora. I think this was the birthday gift one year. I'm not sure where this came from. Or maybe I got it. No, this wasn't the birthday gift. I don't know. It's a philosophy, pure beginnings, mighty mini set. And um, so this bundle sold together for 30 bucks. 30 bucks. Here's that. Yeah, this was from a estate sale, from that beauty lot I got. That's what that was from. Okay. Okay, I gotta check the phone again. But now I don't have to scroll down. <gasps> Counter offered. What's happening? We got a counter off. Okay, I can't let this go for 20. That's not going to happen. <laughs> oh, wait. It's down so low. I offered 34. This thing is way cool to be for $34. Maybe I think it's cooler than what it's actually worth. What is it? The Notori. Uh -huh. See, look. That one. Oh, uh, yeah, that one's nice. Yeah, but I, the offer is all the way down to $34. And she offered 20. Should I Ooh. counter at 30? Sure. Counter at 30. I just think that's so cool. Okay, the moral of the story is, the reason why I did the offers today, to meet our daily goal, yes, but they're all good for 24 hours, and it goes into payday. You feel? It's Thursday right now when we're filming. Good so I figure like it's a good time to do our offers. That's a good idea. And then Smart. tomorrow I might do closet clear out. Uh oh, that's pretty aggressive. I'm aggressive. I'm trying to make that money, honey. <clears throat> Can't make money if you don't sell anything. That's true. All right, bundle. Bundle Poshmark. is bundled. 
Dallas, Texas. Stain, local. Next is a J. Jill open cardigan. This got lost in the shuffle somehow. This is a really good piece. J. Jill navy long open cardigan. It's plus size. I think it's a 3X. I don't know why it's in the poly mailer, but... Because we were assuming it was going to sell on eBay and it would still go first class just barely like that. Or maybe not. You crazy. I think maybe we ran out of bags. We may have run out of bags. It's too heavy. <laughs> this is a J. Joe cardigan. I don't know if he'll open and show you or not. You've seen them before. Open cardigan. It sold for $31. And it was the first thing to sell on the sale. Sold very quickly. It's very crammed in there. I'm just going to leave it. Yeah. Mmm. Somebody again is asking about our t-shirt bags. I don't think people know that these bags exist and they use the crinkly bags. We can't do that. We hate that. Um, I'm going to tell you what size they are one more time. And we're going to put a link, not to these, but to some better ones, hopefully. These are... Like the whole, whole bag with the... I think they're supposed to be 12 by yeah. 10. 10. They're by 10 by 12 zip lock bags. I don't have them link below because I hate them. <laughs> I love the size. 10 by 12 is awesome. And I got these off Amazon. We've gotten them twice now. The first ones were amazing. And Thanks. these have lowered in quality. They're not good. The zipper is really hard to zip. So I can't recommend them. But the size, if you want to go look for some zip top bags that are 10 by 12, is perfect for clothing. Yeah. Like chef's kiss, perfect. The zipper on these is not good. So I, I will not recommend them. I'm sorry I can't put a link. <laughs> I won't do that to you. They're that bad. But the ones we had like six months ago were really good. All right, give me that sport coat. We're selling a Zania sport coat. I'm gonna write it on here. What's the number? The number is 4380. We just sold this for 40 bucks, right? Yep. And it's a tan sport coat. you. Xenia is one of my favorite menswear brands to pick up. This is a really nice jacket. Here you go. Nice. Yeah. For 40 bucks is really nice. It's but super nice. We still made a lot of money on it. We paid two. What did we pay for? I keep looking at that receipt and it's not that one. Six ninety nine. E. Well, it's, it's sorry. Not bad. It's been listed a while too. Yeah. It's a good coat. Good job. Good sale. Yes. Go team. Yes. Um. So April's going to be helping us at the beginning of the summer with the transition to the garage. Leave your questions down below. Happy to answer them. And um, then after the transition to the garage she's going to be helping us daily so we're just going to crank out listings like you wouldn't even believe we're going to make a little photo station she's very excited to plan the office area <laughs> that's all she kept talking about yeah. i can help you plan the desks and everything i'm like okay cool so that's exciting and um there are some questions on how much we pay April and I think that's fair if we're gonna tell you how much we make if part of that is paying April yep. and we pay her three dollars an item to list things for us she takes the photos the measurements and then she <clears throat> uploads the photos into a draft in eBay and fills in a lot of the item specifics almost all okay. of them there we go so that's great three bucks an item it's worth it for us and it's worth it for her it's worth everybody's time yes. right all right, we're gonna move over to eBay and then pop back over to Poshmark at the end if we need to. This is a Charles Gray. Um, and a lot of people are gonna come on here and say, yes, we could get someone cheaper on Fiverr overseas. I understand that. But um, April is very near and dear to us. So if we can provide her with employment and experience, we're gonna do that all day long. Oh man, 
It's an old one. I remember this. We've had this thing yeah, literally had forever. One. Not literally forever. No, Figuratively I know. forever. I know. This is Charles Gray. It's a British brand. And this is just a little swing coat. I don't want to unfold it because it's just so nice. We've had this since the beginning of our reselling journey as well. Size extra small. It looks a lot like Bowden. A swing coat just kind of is an A-line and kind of think 60s. You know, you could wear it with some like knee socks. <laughs> it's a really fun coat. It's double breasted. Double breasted means that it crosses over and it has these buttons down the front. What was the inventory number on that bad boy? I just handed it to you. Um, 89. 89. We're about to breach into the 9,000s. <laughs> <laughs> this is number 89. So cute. It sold for 20 bucks. It's going to Washington, D.C. So happy. That's where I'm from, and it's going home. All right. We used to store our stuff in Tyvex. We don't do that anymore because we wanted to have a little more protection. And these get like gnarly and you can't reuse them and we were wasting a bunch of material. We didn't like that. Okay, the next thing is a flawed cashmere piece. Excuse me, sorry, pardon me. Sorry. Uh, it's a very nice sweater, so I want to show it to you, but it is flawed, so it only sold for ten dollars. Mm -hmm. But we found it it was flawed after we had taken the photos. So those are one of this is one of the times where we just list it because we already put work into it. Yep. And um, I thought it was nice enough that it's not shrunk, but I thought it was nice enough that someone would might want to repair it. And I guess someone did. I have no idea where the flaw is. There's a hole in this somewhere. <laughs> There's always a hole in cashmere. Don't get it twisted. Okay, the Charles Gray is in a box. 11.6. By 2.5 by 13.4. One pound, eight ounces. That couldn't have fit in a flat rate? It was like not that big. Yeah, I mean, probably, yeah. What's going on with you? So they paid $12.99, so I was like. Oh, okay. Anyway, this is J. Crew 100% cashmere. And uh, there's a flaw in it somewhere. And I can't find it now. <laughs> April listed this. She had indicated that there was a flaw on it. She puts it in the title if there's a flaw. I don't know. <laughs> I don't That's know all what... right. There, mm, did I just see it? Little hole in the collar. I mean, it's so tiny. Yeah. Tiny flaw. No, I didn't put tiny flaw. I put flaw. Let's see. Let's look at the pictures here. Ten bucks. That's okay. Not going to the landfill. There's a small spite of spot of very light discoloration on the front. Discoloration. Uh -huh. right. You guys probably saw it on the camera because the camera picks that kind of stuff up. Much better. Yeah. Um, the next is another really small sale, but whatever. I went through this phase of like scrapbooking. I got all this free scrapbook stuff, so I listed it all in lots. <laughs> this is all spring themed, which is good. It's just three little scrapbook things. And we need to put these in some kind of cardboard as well so they don't get messed up. Anyway, the brand is Reflection Recollections, what I think is Michael's. And it sold for $5. I need some tabs. Seven ounces. Can you reach the tabs? Yeah. Oh. You're getting close. Oh. Okay. You checking out Poshmark? Okay, we sold one more thing so far. It's a okay. t-shirt. Star Wars. For fourteen dollars. Someone in our Facebook group called April April One Kenobi and she's she keeps saying it. She's <laughs> cracking up. She loves it so much. 
Why can't I ever find the number on Poshmark? Like the inventory number. I have the J. Crew. Did you get the seven? Yeah. yeah. Two ounces for the other thing. The scrapbook stuff. Hey. Oh. Hey. Buddy. Hey. Hey, buddy. Next is free people. There you go. This is the second time this top has sold. It's a drapey top. It's kind of like, I don't know, kind of like a kimono. It's open and it's short in the front. Hey, high low hems are back. Whoa, that's truth. And this thing didn't get paid for the first time, but someone else bought it and then it got paid for immediately. Sold for $25. The title was Free People Size Small Pick Me Up Drapey T Top Handkerchief Very Oversized Taupe. Very oversized. It's cool though. Man, I feel like I could wear this. Probably good. <laughs> I want to wear everything with <laughs> Anyway, 25. That's great for free people. Why can't I find the inventory number? Oh, 3148. 3148, Star Wars. So for 14. Three, one, four, eight. Three, one, four, eight. Another oldie, but a goodie. Nice. Yes. Uh, 12 ounces for that guy. Okay. Next is a little jelly cat. This yeah. guy is so cute. I think he was in one of my bins videos. We gotta hit it. Dust went everywhere. <laughs> this is the, so I'll show you the jelly cat tag. It's a little jelly cat. <clears throat> Most of the little jelly cats make noise or have a rattle or something. Um, little jelly cat London Boing Nubby Frog Green Noodle Plush Toy, eight inches, sound works. Sold for $25. <laughs> we love it so much. It's like, I'm gonna be very sad to lose. You know, I'll be working over there and Dan will be like, all the time. <laughs> Like, oh, nubby. <laughs> One more time. For One more time. I'll meet you, friend. Okay. Bye, friend. Suffocation warning. 25 bucks. That's good. Checking Poshmark again. the hustle in the hustle couple today let me just say we as hustlings oh she counter offered 25 she came up to 25 should we take it for okay. the natori sure little jelly cat seven ounces no six right at six six point zero next are a pair of toms <laughs> Where's those toms? Oh, down here? Oh my god. The mailman's gonna be like, what? <laughs> 4871. Mail person, excuse me. Now, do I wanna take 25? I'm gonna take 25. Take 25. I'm gonna take it. Can't be a reseller if you don't sell things. That's exactly right. So this is going to be. Told you it's a telethon today. Hopefully this is giving you some inspiration to maybe run a sale of your own. Five, zero, six, five, Naturi. Sold for $25. This is $5. I also put a shipping discount, just so you know. Blue Toms. Blue Toms sold. Yay. For $18. I think they're going first class, right? They are going first class. Let me pull this. 5065. Huh. We are 
10 ounces for the Toms. Yeah, we've had this in a long time. It's in the fives. Wow. So, yeah, we've had it a long time. Okay. All right, next is, I just listed this. April took pictures. We found, Dan and I each picked <laughs> this up at the bins. It was in one of our videos. Yep. He picked up one and I picked up the other and we didn't know each other picked it up. It's a, I think it's an emo band called Microwave. And this is their Death is a Warm Blanket shirt. But the fact that both of us picked <laughs> this up in two different sizes is telling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we both were like, dude, check it out. <laughs> I have to get this. This sold overnight for $18 on an offer that they sent. And I'm really happy with that. So hopefully the other one sells too. Yeah. There was none listed on eBay. of the, There were microwave shirts of the band, but not this one. So this I'm glad. This is the best one. It's the best one. <laughs> Death is a Warm Blanket. Still scrolling offers. See, I almost missed that counter offer because there's so many to scroll through. Man. Watch, if we're over by just the amount of these posh sales, I'm gonna be, you know, if we make our goal, I'm gonna yeah. be so happy. Uh, nine ounces for the microwave t-shirts. Next is a pair of shoes from our haul, the same one where we got the Toms, the Van Haul. Van these are haul. These are cool shoes. We have two pairs of these. They are really cool shoes. Icon wearable art, women's size eight, low moccasin, Robin Palenker, Predator black leather. So basically they're loafers that have like paintings or modern art on them, on your feet. It's like you could have like a Monet on your feet or like a Van Gogh. But a lot of the ones that we got are like artists we don't know. We're like, who's that? It wasn't, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. They're more like lesser known artists and I think that's cool. Because I think if it was like, you know, if you had a Monet on your feet, it would be a little more cheesy, like gift shoppy. But these look, I'm going to put air pockets in these. This is like a lady and a man kissing or something. But it looks like artistic, you know what I mean? You didn't get this at the gift shop. Oh. Oh. I guess that's part of it. It doesn't feel like scuffed. Okay. I mean, I definitely took close-up pictures of all that. Yeah. I can't, no, feel it though. There's no way. Oh, yeah, it's got to be the print. I think it's the print. Yeah. It feels perfect. These air pockets are really big. <laughs> you need some smaller ones? Maybe they're smaller. Oh, a little air. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Will that do? I love that you guys are watching this in real time, watching these offers come in. It's still sending offers. It sent 1,200, so it takes a while. Oh, someone's canceling. Who's canceling? Oh, that was earlier. Okay, you want to jump back to Poshmark? Sure. Open? Did you print? Poshmark 
Wait, are these Poshmark? This one's Poshmark. The label's got a solid, solid key. Those are posh marks. Well, it had a label in general, so. Oh. Duh. Duh. We haven't done the labels yet. I'm gonna be checking this right up until Dan goes to the post office, trying to meet our goal. You know, if some sell, we'll just do it in our what's sold tomorrow. But it's fun when they come in real time, isn't it? Mm-hmm. This is the Notori, I'll show you this. You didn't even show them the shirt. Oh well, it's fine. It's a Star Wars t-shirt. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. Um, this, look how beautiful this is. Bell sleeves, it's like a nightgown dress. It's stunning. I don't know why it took so long to sell and why it only went for 25 but I love it. I should have kept it. should have kept it. Look at that. I would have kept this. Oh, that's nice. I would have worn this. Looking like Miss Roper. Mm -hmm. would have worn it in a video. Coming back on up to <laughs> Can you see it? You can see it. I can see it. I can see it. She's my, like, TV idol. I love Miss Roper. All right, that looks like it for the minute. Okay. And if anything comes in after we do labels, we can still print the label and put it in the bag. We're at 4.27 right now, so that's fine. That's fine. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. We're fine. <laughs> We're not in a rush. Ten things on Posh and eight on eBay. I'm, I'm okay with that. 18. We were sitting at like 13 for a long time today and I was <laughs> starting to get a little worried. Like, this is not good. I wish you could kind of manipulate eBay in the way that you can like do a flash sale on Posh. Is there a way? Do you guys know? Let me know below if there's a way that you know to kind of do what I'm doing where you can just like blast offers out because I'll do it. You're not afraid of flashing out to offers. I'll blast them. Okay. I will I'll blast them. <laughs> I mean really though. something to tell you uh -oh, what's if that? you're watching this right now it's april 20 when you're seeing this april 28th you have until april 30th to bring 20 pairs of full-length jeans to any made well store any pairs they can be damaged it doesn't matter as long as they're full length and you get a free pair of jeans what free wow one per person so like Dan can get, if he brings 20 pairs and I bring 20 pairs, we can each get a free pair up to like $148 free Madewell jeans. That's So you could resell them or like, we're going to go buy ourselves some jeans and act like we're rich for a minute. Yeah, man. We're going to be like, oh, new jeans. <laughs> I'm going to try on everything. And we're bringing April too. I was like, April, go through your closet. So we're going to go through our Goodwill bags, you know, the redonates. We're going to go through our death pile. I guess if you didn't have a death pile, you could go to the bins because you would probably, what, spend $20? If that. Well, yeah, jeans are jeans are heavy. a little bit heavy, but you could get the smaller kind of jeans or the less heavy ones, and then twenty dollars into a hundred and forty dollar pair of jeans. I'm just saying, I'm putting it out there. It's for Earth Day. They're recycling the denim to be used <clears throat> as insulation and such, and I think it's a good cause. And all of us have extra jeans. If we're resellers, you got jeans. Yeah, you do. You probably got some you're gonna try on for yourself and they didn't work out. Put them. Get yourself twenty jeans. It has to be in store though, so you got to see if you have a Madewell store near you. Okay. That's the end of my announcement. Ready? Yes. 89. Big priority box. So weird. 89. <laughs> 6678. 
two, three, four, eight. Seven, three, five, three. Jelly cat. Where'd he go? Oh, he's in. He's over there. Where? Oh. Boing. Four eight seven one. Six nine four one. Four nine one zero. All right, I gotta check Poshmark one more time. Okay, all right, all right. Might as well, right? Yeah. I'd have. Uh, what? I'm up on my email screen. We don't have, we don't have another email. Well, what about an offer? You get an email for an offer? Sure. Yeah, kind of like this. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. Maybe, so it's, guess, maybe yeah. it's slow, though. Just guess let me check. Good. All right. I'm going to check. Give me that pen, please. Thank you. Oh, Aha! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. See? We just sold something, etc. Longview, Texas. Yes. Okay, and since these are offers going out, I think we don't have that cancellation three hour window thing. All right. All right. So this is number 7436. 7436. It's also the first etc. we have sold. 7436. 7436. Sold for $35. Yes. Very this nice. is one of those newer to us brands that we're trying. It's brand new with tags. It's pretty. I told That's you it was awesome. going to be like a telethon. I had a feeling. <laughs> so, y'all, I can't recommend this brand. In fact, I didn't think it would ever sell. But this is new with tags, so we decided to try to list it because it was pretty. And maybe this brand does sell. It definitely just sold for thirty-five on Poshmark, which is pretty good. I would say so. Yeah. Look how pretty this is. So I'm not mad about that. Not at all. It says six fifty-nine, but that's not true. It's three fifty-nine. Yeah. I'm actually gonna. I don't know. I want to put this like, in a box or something. I don't... I feel bad putting it in a tie book. Why? I don't know. Because it has tags. And they paid $35. That's so good. <laughs> so like I've been saying all week, this is 100% silk as well. That's another reason why we decided to list it. Because yep. sometimes brand is not everything. It's about the fabric content. And um, we've been trying different brands. Not we have a bunch of et cetera, okay? Mm -hmm. I think we listed like two or three things just to like dip the toe, yep. see how it does on which platforms and see. And now that we know that, maybe we can go back through the stuff we've been shelving and see, okay, well, let's try this now. Yeah. It's all like just, man, that was like made for TV today. drama. <laughs> And maybe cross-listed all to uh, a yeah. yeah. I mean, just because we had one sale there doesn't mean it does well on there. This could be a one-off. I don't know, though. I'm about to find out. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know unless you do a little research. Oh, my gosh. I'm so glad that came. Watch that be the thing that put this over. Oh, that'd be awesome. Where's the Poshmark bag? Okay. Oh. Couldn't have, we couldn't have, like, scripted that any better. I know, right? All right, scan forms in the postal service bag. I'm still scanning. I'm like, did I miss anything? There I guess you, you would get emails, right? Yeah, I would get an email. I would get an email. 
Oh my gosh, she purchased it three minutes ago and we've already got it in the bag to the post office. I hope she doesn't try to cancel. Haha, -ha, no. All right, you guys, we'll be back in a few minutes to see if we made our goal today. Fingers crossed. Yes, come on. Picnic. Jeremy, you guys ready for your, for your snacks? The pre-post office snacks? Yes. All right. Back it up. Back it up. <laughs> I know, you're excited. Come on, there you go. You're gonna chew, picnic. Chew. <laughs> Good boy, Jeremy. Say bye. I'm still scanning Poshmark. Oh we sold a pair of jeans while you're gone for okay. tomorrow, so that's exciting. Sweet. You aren't gonna believe this. What? You're just not gonna believe it. You're gonna think I cooked the books. I did not. Oh, man. I did not. Let's see. What? I swear to goodness, everything is like, you could double check my math. Wow. We made, so I started the sale at 3.30. Oh. It finished at 4.30, like sending out the offers. Yep. And we made 86 bucks in profit <laughs> in an hour, which is great. That's awesome. I want to show you Posher VA. It's an extension. We're not affiliated with any of these companies. Uh, it's an extension for Google Chrome. And I pulled it up in the, you can just have it as the extension, but I pulled it up here so you could maybe see it. Oh, okay. So this is what I did. It went actions, send bulk offers. I did 30% with $5.95 shipping, all items. I just did all items with a minimum net earnings of $8. And I included new tags, but you could exclude them. There's this way to do a, I don't know how you do that. And then you, it tells you the actions down here. So you can see that it started, did 1194 items that had at least one like. Oh, it started at 304 and then it finished at 428. Okay. So in an hour and a half, we were able to make two, three, four, five sales for, well, six, because we sold the made well while you were gone, but yeah. five sales for a total of $86 profit. Oh, that's great. With the cost of goods taken out. And so we were able to make our goal literally, I mean, like to the penny, basically, mm -hmm. with uh, with that tactic. I, I don't do it a lot. I don't know if you did it more often. I don't know. I, <laughs> I just tried it and it works. So maybe try it. I'm sure it would have worked better if I would have been like 50% off. But I was just like right. tiptoeing into it to try. I mean, 30% is not little. No, it's not. But it all adds up and we made our goal today. Oh, thank yes. you. Yes. Guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us. We appreciate it. Have yourselves a great weekend. Bye.